Hey everyone, Josh here. Working on my 2006 Volkswagen Jetta TDI with the BRM and it's a DSG transmission. Uh, last couple of videos I did replace the cam, I put a new timing belt on, um, I had some weird electrical issues, the P1501 which was the fuel pump relay short to ground and the P338 which was a glow plug controller circuit fault and um, Cut that all together, got it running. I was gonna adjust the cam torsion value, and then I had a tandem pump um, leak from when I had it off for the cam. Um, everything was working fine. I took the pump off, resealed it, put it back together, and now I've got this issue. So I've always had this turbocharger boost control sensor issue. Um, that's going to be getting tuned out, so I'm not too concerned on it. What I don't like is the engine speed sensor is no longer working. So, turn the lights on here. <laughs> As you can see it runs, but the tack doesn't work. So the cr crank position sensor or engine speed sensor on these are in a terrible spot and behind the engine filter housing. Um, I don't even know if I can get a good clear picture of it. Um, the PRM's also had issues with wiring, which as you can see I've got the loom on the main harness all tore apart. Um, these four wires here, three are for your engine speed sensor, one is for your um, oil pressure sensor. So that's just, the oil pressure is just a straight black wire. And the other three um, are black, the red tracer, brown, and purple. So I've been chasing the wires through here. I kind of figured it was a wiring issue because it worked fine until I, I kind of moved some of the stuff around to get the tandem pump out and um, stripped all the harness back. Somebody's been in there because it was all wrapped with uh, cheap electrical tape. And I've gotten to this point. Let's see if I can't find the wire here in the mess. There, the wires are on the bottom side there. So I've got two wires, as you can see. That black one there, there's this one here, and a couple, like big green one with the twisted wire here. The corrugated loom has chewed into it and it's all corroded and, well, this one's not connected anymore, as you can see. Um, these are a fairly common issue on these, I guess with the way the wires are all routed and it wears on the corrugated loom. So I'll try um, fixing this up, wrapping up with tape and, uh, See if everything works. So there's my two wires. I just twisted together temporarily. Uh, but I'm not sure what the one does. The other one goes to my crank position sensor. So feeling pretty confident. Uh, the wires were blue quite a ways back. So I'm going to splice in a short repair wire. I've got a spare engine sitting here. I can rip the harness out of and splice in as need be. So I'll clear the codes here. Helps with the keys on.
Oh, we have speed. So that's good. EGR fault and mass airflow since I have it unplugged. Uh, I'm not sure if those two are related or not, but I haven't had those yet. Um, I guess the turbo code's gone, so that extra black and red wire must have been for it. So um, it's looking pretty good. I can adjust the cam torsion value now.